The Riti is a less common but flexible opening that controls the center with the knight before committing a pawn. d5 occupies the center and controls the e4 and c4 squares. The king's Indian attack prepares to develop the bishop to g2, allowing black to build up a strong center which white will later try to undermine. And c6 develops the knight toward the center and controls the e5 and d4 squares. This is a fair move. It is good. Bg2 puts the bishop on the long diagonal in a move called a fianchetto. e5 adds a defender to the d4 pawn and opens the diagonal for the queen and bishop to develop. The bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is the last book move. A solid choice. It is excellent. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This misses a better way to develop a bishop off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is good. Very precise. It is best. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. It is an inaccuracy. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. It is best. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a knight. It is an inaccuracy. Right on target. It is best. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to develop a bishop off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This overlooks an opportunity to threaten winning a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This moves the knight to safety. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is excellent. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. Takes back. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This is the strongest option. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. Very precise. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This fights against the opposing rook for the open file. It is best. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. This allows the opponent to activate a rook by getting it to the seventh rank. It is an inaccuracy. This misses an opportunity to activate a rook by getting it to the seventh rank. It is an inaccuracy. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The game was close to balanced, but now white is worse. It is a mistake. This offers an equal trade of pieces. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Takes back. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to add a defender to a vulnerable pawn. It is a mistake. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. This threatens to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is best. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. Takes back. 
it is best. This is an equal trade. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. This exposes an attack, threatening a pawn. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is good. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Takes back. This threatens to activate a rook by getting it to the seventh rank. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This places a rook on the seventh rank, activating the rook and restricting the opponent's king. It is excellent. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This overlooks an opportunity to win a pawn. It is a miss. That's fine. It is good. Right on target. It is best. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. It is excellent. This protects the attacked pawn. This threatens to reveal a check. It is excellent. This is the only good move. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal a check. It is a great move. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. This misses a much better move. It is a mistake. This misses a better way to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is an inaccuracy. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This doubles the rooks onto a single file, which allows them to team up to create threats. This is the only move that works. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a great move. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. This stops the opponent from being able to activate a rook by getting it to the 7th rank. It is good. This is the strongest option. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. Takes back. This is the start of the end game and black is equal. It is best. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is best. There was only one good move there. This overlooks a better way to evade the check from the opposing rook. This permits the opponent to use a rook to counter a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This puts the rook behind an opposing passed pawn, which helps counter the pawn's push to promotion. This is the only move that works. This took advantage of a mistake and black now has a winning advantage. This threatens to win a rook. It is a great move. Very precise. It is best. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a mistake. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to double rooks on a single file. It is a miss. This is the only move that works. This threatens to play checkmate. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a great move. This threatens to kick a rook. This prevents the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is best. This threatens to create a passed pawn. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses an opportunity to defend a pawn that was under attack. It is a mistake. There was only one good move there. This permits the opponent to fork pieces. It is a miss. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. This is the only good move. This was a game-changing move, giving black a winning position. It is a great move. This evades the check from the rook. It is excellent. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is best. This protects an underdefended pawn that is under attack. It is good. Right on target. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. 
The past pawn moves towards its goal. It is excellent. The pawn is now passed because it can no longer be challenged by opposing pawns as it tries to promote. It is best. This threatens to play checkmate. It is excellent. This stops the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is excellent. This threatens to play checkmate. It is best. This prevents the opponent from being able to play checkmate. It is excellent. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This threatens to play checkmate. It is best. This move puts the rook on a safer square. It is best. This activates a rook by getting it to the 7th rank and also restricts the opponent's king. It is excellent. A very strong play. It is excellent. A solid choice. It is excellent. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. Placing a rook behind an opponent's passed pawn can inhibit the pawn's ability to promote. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This blocks the check from an opposing rook. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. It is best. The passed pawn moves towards its goal. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. A solid choice. It is excellent. This is the strongest option. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This steps away from the checking rook. It is excellent. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. That was a free pawn. It is excellent. A very strong play. It is excellent. This is the way to win a rook. It is excellent. Intense that was a serious game. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. The players battled pretty evently in the end game.